Hi, this is Chelsea with Crush Customs in Atlanta, Georgia. We're right outside of Atlanta at Upfix. I'm with Ernest. Ernest, you repair all kinds of computer modules and displays, factory repairs. What cars does this go into and what are the problems that you see with this particular unit? So the Mopar family, you know, owns Chrysler, Dodge, and Jeep. So you have the Grand Cherokee, Compass, Patriot, Liberty, and Wrangler. So you can find this actually on a lot of vehicles. So a lot of customers have this t specific tip -um inside their Jeep. It's a mixture of a fuse junction box and what's called a tip -um, totally integrated power module. Now these are found in a lot of vehicles of Dodge and Chrysler's like the Grand Caravans, the Ram, pickup trucks, 1500s, all the way to 3500. So you probably had quite a few customers that drove into your shop with this tip -um actually in there. And uh, as you can see on the front, it's got a whole bunch of relays and fuses. As a courtesy, we check every single one. We pull out all the relays and on the bench, we bench test every single one, replace any of the faulty ones. That's just a st common courtesy that we do. But the real repair happens when we take this entirely apart and fix the relays that are soldered into the circuit board. So if the vehicle is not starting, there's fuel pump issues, the horn, uh, power windows, rear and front windshield. You would think that they would have a replaceable relay for it, but it's actually soldered in. You have to completely disassemble this unit. So if you have a customer that says, hey, you know, I wish I could get my windows work here and my, my car is sometimes cranked, sometimes it doesn't, chances are it's this right here. And if I went to the dealership with that problem, they would probably tell me that I needed the whole unit replaced. Exactly. They're not going to just sell you, uh, you know, a circuit board by itself. They're going to say, replace this entire piece. And it starts very expensive. And it goes to even more expensive. Oh, yeah. Okay. yeah. If it's available. Exactly. If it's not on back order, uh, depending on the year, make and model. Because these tip actually come in different shapes and sizes, but this is a very popular version, and they are known to fail, for sure.